Excel has many inbuilt functions. And if you need to create your own functions, then you can create it using Visual Basic Macros or Excel add-ins. But are you aware that you can create your own functions even without using add-ins or macros? In Office 365 version of Excel, a new functionality called Lambda functions are introduced. So what is Lambda functions? So it is basically a functionality which converts a complex Excel formula into your custom functions. So let's see this in action with an example. As you can see, I have written few dates. Now I want to extract financial year from this date. So basically by financial year, I mean Indian financial, which starts from 1st April and ends at 31st March of next year. So I want financial year, something to be written like this. FY dash, now since this is 15th July, so it would be 2022 dash 2023. So I want to make function which would give me output like this. First, let's prepare this using Excel formula. So I'll start drafting Excel formula. So is equal to in double quotes, FY dash. So this is textual version. And I would then concatenate, let me join text, so add. If no, so first, let's extract month from it of this date. So this function would extract month. So if this month is April or up to December, so greater than or equal to four, that means April or above. Then comma. Then our year would be this year. That means 2022 dash 23 means one year start and end year 2022-23 so i would write something like this extract year from this join this with dash and again extract year plus one otherwise first First, we will test this. Okay, I will. I am writing blank here. Okay, so this is correct. So let's now write our else portion. So else portion is simple. I would copy paste this. Only thing is that this would be year minus one. That means one year before, and I would remove plus one from this. Okay. So let's test it. Imagine that instead of it 15th July, it is 15th March. 15th March, then our financial year would be 2021-22. Okay, so friends, this formula is working perfectly. Now, before I turn this into a custom function, so naturally you may ask that why I need a custom function using Lambda function when I can achieve this using even Excel formula. So just imagine case like this. So instead of, so you draft formula here and someone says that there, are, there is some data in C and D column. We want it in F column. So naturally you would be copy and pasting this. Okay. Now cell references have also been dragged because it is a relative. So naturally you will have to keep on doing like this, which is very cumbersome or so you need to change everywhere, wherever D4 is there, you need to change it to B4. Okay. Like this. So this is very tedious or even imagine case something like this. So let's say if date is here. And I want this expression to even work here. Okay. Again, I have to substitute. So I have to find replace G2 with H1. So again, this is a very tedious thing. So now let's see how Lambda function can make your life easier. Okay. So let's 
so now the syntax of lambda function is is equal to lam pda lambda okay lambda function expects two inputs so first one is now since you would be turning this into custom functions so now no more cell reference would be there so instead of cell reference it would be parameter reference so you have to define parameters so you can use short variable names something like this dt so input for this is a date okay so you can see a date being used so this cell is being referenced by four times okay so i would first actually copy paste this okay excluding equal to i would copy paste this okay is equal to lambda so parameter so instead of cell b4 let's say that we represent b4 by variable name dt comma calculation or excel formula okay now here so i would paste this now instead of b4 if you see if you write dt see there would be a variable created yes so everywhere b instead of b4 i would write dt 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 let's ensure our all the brackets gets completed okay so now this is converted to custom function okay where instead of cell references we have parameter references i'll press enter okay now by default one error comes that you cannot define a lambda function in a cell so see we have tied up this to a cell whereas a lambda function or custom function can be used anywhere and again this function is not having any name so what excel says that you need to copy paste this entire thing including now equal to also so i would select this entire excel formula or function lambda function control c and we would need to go to formula tab name manager and here now we can define our lambda function so new okay now you need to name your function custom function so let's say i give name fy very short and simple and i would select and delete this and paste that complete lambda expression here so now excel has created one new function called fy wherein a custom function was inserted close this now i can delete it okay so now for comparison purpose i would keep both okay so this was done using custom excel formula and let's see how you can do this using lambda is equal to fy okay you can see this in even drop down bracket open date tt so i would simply reference this cell bracket close okay now i can copy by something like this now the beauty of this that it seems very clean just see expression like this and how does this feel fi so it looks very clean and manageable so let's say you want to use this thing inside another formula excel formula so this is is a very short thing instead of this a very big expression so ultimately you would be messing up the original formula with this expression which would really turn things complicated and beauty of this so if i now copy paste something like this here i just need to drag and correct one cell reference like this instead of excel formula where i need to actually keep on correcting references like this okay so let's see which one is simple i guess fy this lambda function is pretty simple compared to your excel formula if you like this video and technique please don't hesitate to press like button there is no cost for it and also subscribe to the youtube channel and lastly i know you have one doubt in your mind what if you have perpetual version of 
Excel like Office 2013, 16, 19, 21 like this because Lambda function is not available in that. So answer is simple. Just upgrade to Office 365. So let me make it clear. So I don't get any incentive or commission from Microsoft to promote their product. I purchase it because I like to explore new techniques and when I catch hold of any new technique, I always like to share it with all of you.